at Yarmageddon 8 after our interval. Bankers Club made their presence known in the halftime, attempting to assault the radio presenter who came in just to just add a little bit of fun involved, telling uh, Mark Lowe, telling it to get out of the ring. And the Rockers making their presence by like coming out and saying, well, you know what, you're going to have a kick out, we'll come in and take our place. I mean, they ultimately saved the day for they sure. They absolutely did. And Mark Lloyd, the most advantageous wrestler in DOA's entire roster, winner of the 2017 Adrenaline Cup, maybe not by the most legitimate means, as I'm sure Alexander Roth will tell anyone, but still the winner nonetheless and the keeper of the title in the Adrenaline Division. Got that from Ash Draven, who is obviously going to be watching this very carefully. That's right. A man who has made a very set of wise investments and now has the newest acquisition to the Bankers Club, squaring off oh, with one half of the Rockers. Straight out the gates, Charlie Winston going straight after Nick Andreas. Kind of going for that rugby tackle in the corner. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Sean Stocky, that's exactly my frame. And I can tell you that just because he's small does not mean he's not powerful. When I did rugby in school, it changed you for conditioning, for strength, and it means you've got a good uh, center of gravity. So if you try and do anything like throwing your opponent around, you're going to be much easier to lift them up. See, much, much easier. I'm not quite sure the camera does Charlie Winston justice. No, he is a big that man. That is an absolute <laughs> huge, wow. huge guy. But look oh. at that. Look at that spear in the Nick, corner. Nick Andreas and with another a few one. tackles of his own. Oh! Charlie Winston out of nowhere. Just cleaning house. And now Charlie Winston just cross face smashes to Nick Andreas. And this guy, I mean, teases not very often I'm left speechless by, by a, someone's sheer presence, but Charlie Winston is an absolute mountain of a man. Yeah, he. It's very tall. I mean, to me, everyone's very tall because I'm five foot four, but uh, very tall nonetheless, even for my standards. And then there goes Mark Lloyd. And I think the crowd, I think it's 90% of the crowd here paid their money to see him get his ass kicked and they're going to get their money's worth oh, without, right without, now. Without, oh, look at another shoulder tackle in the corner. Oh, oh my goodness, assisted shoulder tackle. Oh, wow. and another basement shoulder tackle. Totally measuring him. And they're just uh, waiting uh, to get back oh, up. And, oh, that's a conversion. One, two, that's it. Oh, no. Make no mistake, Mark Lloyd is a very gifted wrestler, even if he has to go through some less than legitimate means to win the big one. Well, how he many, is still how gifted. many honorable bankers have you ever met? Uh, my accountant, that's it. <laughs> and I say that because I hope they're not skimming off the top. Just a two count there, but it's getting harder and harder for Mark Lloyd to get his, get his shoulder up. Every time he does, he expends energy against these big, stocky dudes. So much muscle on them that even if they're short, there's a lot of weight just packed into that small frame. Nick Andreas back in now. Very quick tags as well. Very clever to keep the both of them fresh. That's it. The Ruckers know exactly what they're doing inside the ring. You know, we've seen Mark Lloyd prevail in some very tough matches recently. Oh, look at that holding. Look at this. Yes, I'm saying strong base of strength and down he goes. The last time at Yarmageddon 7, Mark Lloyd in that triple threat against Ash Draven and Shogun J. And Another course, gifted wrestler of, in the UK oh, right now. Without a doubt, and of course that the influence match where, uh, where Mark Lloyd managed to win the, uh, win the adrenaline title. And then his first defense against Tim Lee in an absolute barnstormer. Oh, look at this! And wow, that's Charlie Winston proving that he's worth every penny the banker has paid him. And just in comes the big man, and look at the strength. Just picks him up like it's nothing. And this is it. I mean, there are some big guys in that ring, Tej. <laughs> Charlie Winston makes everyone look like they're about your height. Which I'm, I'm totally <laughs> fine with. You know, it doesn't make oh, any less of a man. And a rainmaker elbow there, and a headbutt. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I don't think it's going to do much to someone like Nick Andres who's been in enough scrums in his time. That, on the other hand, might just... You know, have an effect. You take Choke, the, choking him out. There on the taking ropes. the wind out of the uh, the Rucker's uh, Rucker's lungs. If you can't breathe, you can't get any power behind anything you do. No, no, no blood in your no, no oxygen in your blood. Should I say? You can hear those strikes. Charlie Winston going for those huge clubbing blows in the chest again, just working on draining the air. Charlie Winston just the lungs enjoys of this. Nick Look Andreas. at the face on him. And now going for the bear hug, which, again, 
you don't appropriate see, for the size. You don't see a lot of bear hugs these days, but you know what? Charlie Winston, this is very, very smart strategy. As I say, focusing on the lungs, on the on the throat, taking the air, getting out of, under out of those Nick ribs. Andres. Yeah, really starting to constrict the, the chest and the life is just slowly going out of him. We've seen this happen time and time again with the bigger man just squeezes the ever-loving life out of a smaller competitor. This is the thing, without uh, oxygen... And straight back to it again. No oxygen in your bloodstream means that lactic acid builds up in all your muscles. Everything starts to hurt. Every limb gets that bit heavier because there's no oxygen to power your body. You know, I've been in that hole before and it is horrible. Every second feels like a minute. And I think Nick, Nick Andreas is fading here, Teed. Yeah, it's well, that's one. He gets to three, then that is This match could be over out. before 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 uh, Jordan Wade really even really makes a difference in this match. Oh, he's holding oh, on. Matt Ball was ready to call the match. And Nick now Andres. he's got to really try and mount an offense with this little second wind. And Charlie Winston says absolutely not. And again, just working on the ribs and the and the and the, the rib cage. Of, uh, of Nick Andreas, again, just focusing all the attention on draining his body of every drop of oxygen. Yeah, and now Nick Andreas, I'm not sure he knows where he is right now, but still manages to get a boot up. And even, even on the uh, perch on the top rope. Oh, Ooh, very nice shot attack. We still can't get the big man down. He's down to a knee. Down that, to a knee at least. I think even perch on the top rope, getting your foot up, he still couldn't kick Charlie Winston in the face. That's just how and tall Mark this guy is. finally gets back in. We can finally see uh, Jordan uh, Jordan Wade make an impact. Jordan Wade going to all corners here to tackle this, the, the banker down, make sure that he, the adrenaline champion knows who he is. <laughs> Just toying with Mark Lloyd right now. Mark Lloyd feeling the pain, but I can tell you now, a man of his level, he can push through it if he wants to. Oh. Look at that. Another tackle there, but I don't think he's seen Charlie Winston. Or oh, maybe he has. He's oh, got him hooked. But look at this. Oh, oh. Just throws him down like it's nothing. But Mark Lloyd, advantageous as ever, tries to chuck him out and does not quite succeed. And oh, oh slingshot. slingshot spin. Wow. From Jordan Wade. Very nice. Everyone wants to call that a lawn dart that can get a taxi home right now. And now the Rockers, now the Rockers are starting to take control. Uh, he's measuring him. Oh. oh. Again, Charlie Winston proving he's worth the investment. But do not turn your back on the banker. That is not a smart decision. We're about to see a recession. Oh! Wow. A light out of nowhere. And Mark Lloyd going up. Banker's going up. He's about to see a price hike. He's up. He's down wow! with a swanton. My goodness. And that could be all she wrote. One. Two, wow. oh no, but Nick Andreas in to break it up. At the last possible moment, and Nick Andreas want to get some revenge here. Ooh, oh, very nice. Oh my goodness. That was brutal. Oh my Watch goodness. Watch out for the big man. Oh, oh spy Buster. Wow. One, two, Throw! Oh, so close. I cannot get over <laughs> Mark that Lloyd was just sent flying. That was a nasty <laughs> shoulder tackle. Oh, oh my goodness. I teased I'm gonna I'm gonna fight. Jordan that Wade footage. is just the only one alive right now. Oh look at that though! And oh. sends, sends Charlie Winston to the outside. Oh I think I know what's going on. Oh basement. Very nice. Kick. And now we're back down to the two legal men, Nick Andreas and Mark Lloyd. This is going to be a test of wills. Who has more to give? And Mark Lloyd has a lot more to lose. Coming off the biggest wins of his career, he has to be feeling confident. And if someone takes him out in a tag or singles competition without the title on the line, we could see gold being held up for grabs at the next event. So Mark Lloyd has to stake his claim and prove himself to be the top man of the mountain. And both guys in the ring just trading right hands, dropping bombs left, right and centre. And Mark Lloyd got him there, got him up. Oh, oh spinning cutter. The that could be it. One, two. two. Oh, and out goes Charlie Winston holding the doors. 
Just off camera. Oh. Just off camera, folks. Mark Lloyd is on his own. Charlie Winston forced out the fire escape. And you might be able to hear it on the microphone. He is smacking those doors. But Mark Lloyd being advantageous, he's got the briefcase. Oh, the referee's back. He senses an opportunity to capitalize. There's no ref in the ring. Oh, wait, 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 wait. He's not watched though, he's not seeing. But wait a second, back in the ring. Jordan, wait. He's pulled that briefcase oh, away. Oh, watch out. Your investment's oh. gonna bite you back. Oh, he's on the shoulder. Oh, right hand. I don't like where this is going for oh, Mark Lloyd. Mark Lloyd is going straight to the map. Oh, top! Wow. Almost like a doomsday device shoulder tackle. One, two, two three. The Rockets have done it. Beautiful. And Mark Lloyd is going to have a lot to think about. Oh, I'm not sure if Mark Lloyd is going to recall anything that just happened in this match. I'm pretty sure he is suffering with a concussion right now, Teach. And Charlie oh, Winston. Charlie Winston, and Charlie he Winston's is made not it back happy. In. And Teach. The Ruckers just scored a pinfall victory over the DOA Adrenaline Champion. The question is, was it a wise investment on Mark Lloyd's part? And he pushed him off and says, what are you doing? Where were you? I'm not quite sure Charlie oh. Winston has the legs to stand though right now, Siege. This is not a smart decision. And we could be seeing some dissension amongst the ranks. Trouble in paradise in the Bankers Club. Something about the dialects here in Great Yarmouth. Yeah, all I'm hearing is wanker. I can't no, help it. No, it's just the way they pronounce it. It's the way they pronounce it. You sure? It. Mark Lloyd demanding to be announced with the accolades he carries. But now there are three potential people looking to take what is his. And he one of them could be in his own team. Definitely has a target on his back for sure. <laughs> 